there's no lasting happiness if our life is self-centeredness. It means we can't have a happy life if we live within selfishness. In the condition that happens to our world today, some people still not think about others and keep being selfish for themselves. The example is like the shortage of medical supplies like this mask, hand sanitizer, and etc. from panic buying from some people. And there's some people sell this for a high price just for a profit. Can you imagine what will happen if people keep being selfish? What what if other people do to us? From this situation, people that it needs will not survive. The riot, a riot, will happen everywhere, and the society will collapse. People will be more lethal than the virus itself. From the newest data, there are more than 2.4 million confirmed cases of COVID-19 and death of more than 167 thousand people worldwide. With the situation of the this pandemic, most people are struggling every day, not just for a limited medical supplies, but they are struggling to make a life for their families. I had an experience from this COVID-19 when it came up to Indonesia. People try to medical supplies like masks and hand sanitizer at pharmacies. When I look for it, it's already gone. People buy it. All of them. Even worse, some of them try to sell these things with a high price for a profit from this pandemic. What kind of people that do such a shameless thing? like that. Selfishness can be a dangerous and lethal more than a virus. Greediness and fairness consume their heart and become careless to everyone and everything. There are a lot of things of how important selfless are. First, selflessness help improve your relationship, relationship with your family, your friends, or your loved ones. Second, selflessness can keep you healthy. And the third, selflessness give us a new perspective. There was a rich man said to his friend, what is, Why is everyone always criticizing me while I give them everything, what I have? When I, when I am die, I want to give them my richness and my money to them. Well, said the Friend, let me tell you about a pig and a cow. One day, a pig said to the cow, People are always talking, talking about your kindness and your gentleness. You give them a milk and a cream, but I give them more. I give my ham and my bacon, but still, no one likes me. What is it? The cow thought for a minute. And the cow said, well, maybe it's because I give while I'm still living. From the story, we can learn that people always appreciate and love you if you give whatever you have for a good deed while you live for your life as best as you can. Selfishness is an action to not really care about others and keep wanting what you want and pushing that forward regardless of the consequences. Selfless is showing unselfish concern for the welfare for others. Being for myself and being for others is just like two sides of a coin. The same coin. Both are important and essential for flourishing. Instead of seeing a single act of yourself as a whole, as either selfish or selfless, you can begin to yourself as a self, become helpful and caring toward yourself 
and toward others. Rabbi Hill said, If I am not for myself, who will be for me? But if I am only for myself, who am I? If not now, when? You are selfless. You think less about yourself and more about others. You are generous and kind. Being selfless is similar for being altruistic. Another word, for giving the others without looking for a personal gain. If you give time, money, or things to other people without expecting something in return, you are selfless. Most people will agree that the world will be a better place if there were more selfless behavior. Selfless is giving something yours with a heart. Selfless is giving whatever you have to others for good deeds, giving best for others, perfectly. Thinking about everything around you, being more thoughtful. Selfless will guide you to become a better person, a better you. Kindness from others will be returned to you eventually. So, don't be afraid to become a selfless. And now, in the end of my presentation, I want to tell you, people are now realize that humanity and selflessness is important to make the world become a better place. A lot of donation and charity help by people from every country, every religion, every society, and many more. Humanity restored, helping each other from our neighborhood, fight for humanity against the pandemic, and throw away our selfishness. Let's start to think about others. Think about the sick people and poor people. Help them with a donation or a charity. If possible, be a volunteer for humanity's sake. Selfless won't hurt you but it will make world become a better place. Our prime purpose in our life, in this life, is to help others. And if you can't help them, at least don't hurt them. Thank you.